Morning, everybody. Jason, PJ, Hollis Farms. Just want to give y'all a little update of kind of what's going on with us and the YouTube channel. Make this kind of short and sweet. Oh, uh, everybody's doing good. Been doing a pretty good bit of hunting. Uh, been hot, dry, but everybody's doing good. I'm still pissed off at YouTube, but I think I've got every right to be. But anyway, uh, if I'm gonna do this, I guess we're gonna kinda have to do it by the way they uh, they want it done, which is aggravating for what you can see on YouTube compared to what we're doing. It just don't make any sense. But anyway, I was just on the verge of really thinking about quitting, but I, I do like videoing. If I, I have been videoing some, uh, just, had to kind of make some decisions, I guess. It's, you put so much time and effort and some money into these cameras and stuff and for them to do like they did, it's just very, very, very aggravating. But anyway, um, what, what they're going, what they're going to do, they're going to review. We got to take down basically all, probably the hog stuff mainly. I don't know why people going to get aggravated at trapping hogs in the way we do. Uh, I guess probably Aaron to end, I was the only one showing the actual shooting of the hog, which that's what everybody likes, really. But uh, that's probably what got us. It just don't make sense. I, I guarantee you these people complaining about them. If these hogs was rooting in their yard, they'd be calling me or somebody to come get them out. They'd be whining and crying like a baby. But anyway, they probably live around a bunch of concrete and never managed a piece of property and dealt with hogs, but any kind of wildlife, y'all know you got to manage them, but uh, cause them things breed like rabbits are worse. And then they eat everything, every animal eats. But anyway, besides the point, y'all know why we do it and why we, but anyway, so the hog trapping, if I video that, it'll have to be done a little different, which that's okay. Uh, I have uh, talked to some people and kind of seeing how they do it, but. Basically, I think what they, they, the best part they don't want you to show is the shooting. And they talking about the blood and all that. But you can go on there and see a woman's titties or whatever. A big thing now seems like everybody's plopping them out breastfeeding. And you know what they're doing. I mean, they're popping that titty out so everybody can see them and they can get views. I mean, I, I have seen them and they, they, they got the baby feeding there. And, uh, you know, no big deal. And then they plop the other one out. Well, that baby don't need but one tit. They plopping the other one out so uh, they can, you can see it and they can get more views. It's crazy. And I can't even go in there and manage and shoot hogs. But it's crazy world. This world is just, just, I don't know. It's crazy. But anyway, um, so... We've got to, ba they're going to come in there back to the YouTube channel. I th they think it's December 10th. They're going to come back in there and give us a review to see if they're going to let us be monetized again. And uh, basically, we're going to have to go in there and probably delete every hog video we've ever done. And pro I might delete every, we may delete everything and just start over or leave the tractor videos or something. I'm not sure, but. Anyway, it's very aggravating. I feel naked when I get up and not filming every day because I know a lot of people, a lot of y'all like to see the dogs and what I'm doing or whatever uh, amazes me that people watch and see what I'm doing every day. But anyway, I, it's such a habit when you put as many videos as we, we have out. It's such a habit to get up every morning with the camera and just kind of start filming the day. And I hadn't hadn't been doing that and I've been missing it. But anyway, so what I'm doing is I've got a, uh, I've been filming, we've been hunting quite a bit and I've been filming some. I don't know if I'll ever go back to a everyday video possibly. I do like doing them. Uh, but anyway, what I'm doing is I posted a couple on Cody's channel on Hollis Outdoors already. And uh, I'm gonna start posting some there and see if I can get some traction there and get that channel to grow in the meantime. Cause eventually Cody will start video and he's got a, I gave him a couple of my older cameras and he's been, been playing with, playing with them. He enjoys it. Uh, he ain't hardly filmed uh, while he's hunting because I mean, that's a lot. 
lot, it's a lot to do if you hunted a long time, much less when you kind of new at hunting and filming, but he will eventually. He likes playing with the cameras and I uh, think he'll get better by himself and I'm better by myself just talking to the camera, just me and PJ. I get around the crowd, I don't do, do quite as well, but uh, that's the plan. I've already got a couple up on Hollis Outdoors and uh, I'm gonna be posting. I'll probably try to do <clears throat> maybe three a week on that and kind of see how that goes. If it gets to grow and get some good action or something or something good comes, comes along to film, we'll post more, but kind of see how that goes. And then come December 10th for the Hollis Farms channel, we'll just have to see how it goes and see if they let us back in. I don't know. I'm going to, I kind of made my mind up. I'm going to give it one more shot. And if it don't work this time, we'll just uh, have to let her go. Maybe I can work at this time where they won't get it i mean it just came out of the blue woke up one morning and i was looking at the app where we can look at all our analytics and stuff and and it was basically shut down really i mean you can post but there's there's no monetization and, and i hate to say it but if, if it wasn't for that all the, the time and effort and the, the money you spend to do it it's, it's not worth it so as bad as I like, much as I like doing it, I love the comments and reading the, I read all the comments and answer most of them. If they're stupid, I delete them. Uh, every once in a while I get on a rant, but I'm not going to argue with somebody on a, on a comment hardly. But uh, that's the plan. I'm going to post a few on, on Hollis Outdoors and we'll, uh, we'll see uh, how that goes. And uh, anyway, I think we, I got the couple that's ups pretty good already and uh we'll see how it goes i'm trying to do a do a lot of hunting and i got a, another dog that i'm fixing to start trying to train uh, on the track and along with pj so uh things might get pretty good over there y'all go over there and check it out hollis outdoors appreciate y'all watching out of here